this. Good morning, North Point. It's November 14th, 2011. And I'm Sarah Gill. And I'm H.A. Vest. And, and Wake Up North, North Point, Point starts right now. In school news, market day pickup is tomorrow and picture retakes are on the 16th, so make sure you mark your agendas. Let's take a look at today's weather. It is going to be a, be a mild but wet start to this school week with periods of rain through Wednesday morning. A cold front will pass Tuesday night and behind it some cold air will pour into the tri-state. High temperatures by Wednesday will, and Thursday will only be in the 40s with lows tipping to below freezing. Now on to lunch. Today we'll be having hot dog or coney taco mini taco, potato smileys, vegetables, fresh fruit, and veggie choices, and a bagged cookie. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today in the headlines, we're talking about a record breaking run. With the game on the line, rookie Andy Dalton couldn't handle a little old-fashioned Pittsburgh defense. Rashard Mendenhall ran for a pair of touchdowns Sunday, and the Steelers intercepted Dalton twice in the fourth quarter, holding on for a 24-17 victory over the, over the upstart Cincinnati Bengals. The Bengals' season record now sits at 6-3. And now for this day in history. On this day, 1851, Moby Dick, the story of an incredible serial killer and a whale was published. And now on to our fun fact. Did you know that if humans didn't have bones, it'd be floppy like a beanbag? Could you stand up? Forget it. Could you walk? No way! Without bones, it'd be just a puddle of skin and guts on the floor. Still kind of gross. Like I said, gross is my specialty. At least you didn't talk about earwax. Ooh, earwax. Now that sounds exciting. Oh no, not again. Remember, North Point, keep your paws up. Have, Have a great, great day or not, the choice is yours.